Daily Message, January 23rd, 2024. Without facilitating what appears to be a growing paranoia in society today, let us practice caveat emptor. Caveat emptor being an ancient Roman law, which basically means let the buyer beware. A law that wisdom dictates we take to heart in our personal lives today due to those who spend their lives trying to steal from or scam others. The unjust interest rates being charged on credit cards, stolen products being sold on websites, expensive or controlled substance prescriptions being overcounted upon occasion, the as-is sale of homes or cabins, overstated weights on some packages of meat being sold, higher-priced alleged cage-free or organic products being sold, etc. The need for buyers to beware dates back a lot further than Roman law. For in Proverbs 11 verse 1 is written God's view with respect to a dishonest scale. The Lord detests dishonest scales, but an accurate weights find favor with him. And in Deuteronomy 23 verse 19 is written this law of God. Do not charge interest on the loans you make to a fellow Israelite, whether you loan money or food or anything else. So let us be wise consumers by taking cautionary steps to keep from being cheated and to take a stand to preclude others being cheated. For example, by counting the pills when picking up a prescription if it appears to be overcounted and report any shortage by reading several reviews on a product before buying the product, by reading the fine print on all credit card offers, by weighing a package of meat before opening it, if it appears overstated, by not buying stolen products, etc. Let us keep in mind, if it sounds too good to be true, it is in all likelihood not true. May we be blind such that equal justice is administered to all, no matter their economic status, race, culture, sex, or religion, but have 2020 vision when it comes to practicing buyer awareness. With love to all, Pastor Cheryl.